So I had retired as ambassador to Japan, being from the Indian Foreign Service after a 35-year career. Uh, but more than being having been ambassador to Japan, I was known in my service as a Japan specialist. Uh, first, uh, the thing that strikes you when you go to Japan is a punctuality. That is what they expect from others too. Because punctuality means respect for the other person's time. Uh, so either be on time or before time. Uh, so punctuality. Then they are a very focused and dedicated lot of people, dedicated to their job. Uh, and they expect something similar from Indians too. And so that we must show that we are dedicated and that we are capable of going into detail. We Indians are good at uh, broad giving a broad picture and they are very good at going into the minutest detail. So somewhere we have to find a compromise. We should preserve our broad picture but also be capable of going into detail. I am absolutely convinced in fact uh, and my thought was reflected also by Prime Minister Abe when he met Prime Minister Modi in Malaysia last week. He said he cannot think of any other two major countries which have so much mutual benefits uh, like we. Uh, I mean, I'm trying to justify why Japan is so important to this company. Uh, apart from high percentage of our work being related to Japan, I see it as a long term partner because for us, Japanese capital and Japanese high technology will remain relevant for decades to come. 